the job of an investigator is to be a witness for what the animals suffer in the factory farms and slaughterhouses. These type of things that we record, they are going to happen anyway. And uh, we think that it's crucial for the public to know. So we have to be there with a hidden camera or with other methods to show that to the public. And uh, it's a very difficult job, of course, but uh, we think that it's very, very necessary because those things that are not known, that people don't know what is happening, are very, very difficult to change them. At the moment, we're working on the project Eye Animal. This is using virtual reality to show what's happening inside factory farms and slaughterhouses. And uh, I've been in many of these places myself, and I always thought, I wish I could bring people with me here so they could see it by themselves with their own eyes and not through my camera. And uh, using virtual reality allows us to precisely do that. And when people wear these type of headset and watch the footage that we have filmed with 360 degrees cameras, they feel like they are inside those places. So that's what we are currently working on. And the next release is going to be on the life of chickens from the farms to the slaughterhouse. I think the most important thing is for people to become activists and to not only stop to contribute to the suffering of animals and you know change our diet and of course stop contributing to that that is very very important but the moment we start helping them actively try to help them uh, we multiply the number of animals that we are helping so by every person that we're helping to change their diet we'll multiply the number of animals that uh, we were going to save or spare from a life of misery in our whole life i think that is of course, like the, one of the most important things. The other is to be flexible and not be particularly attached to any particular tactic or strategy and be open-minded. With this, I'm currently in charge of the investigations and I think that that is one of the key aspects of this movement. It has many uh, benefits, like uh, helping the public to know what is happening, helping to change the laws in favor of animals, helping companies or helping us to persuade companies to change their policies and uh, I think that is really important for the animal rights movement. Since we started uh, we were looking at uh, what other organizations were doing in other countries and we started to attend other conferences and gatherings and meet with uh, activists from other organizations and share experiences and share learnings with them and uh, we learned a lot uh, from them. So at the moment we are in contact with many groups in many different countries and of course we share tactics, we share some of the knowledge that we have and uh, the best practices on how to help the animals the most because we share that common goal and uh, sharing that information, it, it only benefits the animals.